There's nothing like the pre-storm panic of a hurricane to highlight the need for clean water. Shelves left bare as people race to stock up. But one Florida company has a unique solution for consumers. Drink the air. The humidity is greatest after a hurricane when our machines will be most efficient in making the purest water. Drinkable air creator Jeff Zor shows us how. So this is the drinkable air this machine? This is. Yes, it is. And it's smaller than I was expecting. It, it's the size of basically your water cooler. I'm feeling a fan kind of blowing out some hot air here. Right. What starts the process is obviously drawing the air into the machine. And we have an antibacterial filter. He says the machine works best at 30% relative humidity. At this office in St. Pete, using the technology, you can see it's more than 40%, which should create about five gallons of water in 24 hours. The air goes across. The gas form of the water, the humidity, touches the cold coil, and you can see we're making water. The machine can make about two days' worth of drinking water for 20 employees. It's pulling all the water from the air. Is it clean? Absolutely. Any time that water goes from a gas form to a liquid form, it's pure. And just think about how do we distill water. We boil it, we bring it up to steam, we capture the steam, and bring it back to water, and then it's pure. We do that without the boiling. We do that through condensating water. At $3,400, it is an investment, but will last 12 years with filter changes every six months. The office manager here, where they're developing a cholesterol-lowering drink, says it's easier and cheaper long-term to not have to order jugs of water. I was like, where is it coming from? Is there a drain connected to this? Or where, where is this coming from? But it's coming just from the air that we're breathing. Beyond office settings, drinkable air is releasing a tabletop version for homes. But the creator has a bigger goal that became clear when Irma hit and then Maria, and everyone was running out of water. We put out on social media that anyone that wants to fill their water bottles come to Drinkable Air and we would give three gallons per, per household. We ended up giving out over 100 gallons and selling out of our, uh, uh, our inventory. Turning to the clouds as your water cooler. When a disaster hits, just turn them on. Sorbonne Banerjee, Fox 13 News.